Hi guys, welcome to Classic TV Facts and Trivia. Thank you for being here. Today's video is on All in the Family. It's actually on uh, Sally Struthers and Betty Garrett from All in the Family and how they had so much fun on the set that they had to be physically separated. Uh, to work on the set of All in the Family wasn't just about making people laugh in front of the camera. It was also about making friends and co-stars laugh even when the cameras weren't rolling. From Carol O'Connor to Gene Stapleton being on such a successful series, I left quite a mark on the cast who had uh, developed genuine friendships from behind the scenes of the show. According to Betty Garrett's memoir, Betty Garrett and Other Songs, A Life of, on Stage and Screen, she became particularly close with her fellow cast member, Sally Struthers. Garrett was best known for playing Bunker's neighbor, Irene Lorenzo, uh, who joined the series as a reoccurring character in season four. When Garrett was first introduced to the cast, she was already familiar with many of her new co-stars, save for one, Sally Struthers, who played Gloria. Luckily, the two quickly grew close to their own delight and the possible dismay of the crew. Garrett wrote about the one person involved with the show I didn't know was Sally Struthers, and we quickly became so close they had to separate us during rehearsals. The two shared many similar interests and often had a little bit too much fun when they were on the set together. Garrett continued, uh, we both loved to do crossword puzzles, and we would sit in the corner and giggle until they finally had to make us sit on opposite sides of the room. Garrett said of her co-star, Sally is just the cuddliest, most adorable girl, and when we see each other today, the first thing we do is throw our arms around each other and say, girlfriend. Garrett also had only positive things to say about her fellow actor, Gene Stapleton, who played Irene Lorenzo's best friend, Edith Bunker. She wrote, Gene is one of the most generous, cheerful women I've ever met. I have never known anybody who was so positive, so up about things all the time. She also spoke to the high level of talent that Stapleton acted with and wrote, ever since playing Edith, she has had to strive to get beyond that image. And since it was such an indelible character, uh, you can see how it would be hard for her. But Jean was a great deal of dignity about her. And I think she has been quite successful in changing her image. People came to accept her as something other than a dingbat. I, I love the behind the scenes stuff when they're having fun and enjoying each other. I just think that's really cool. Um, that's all I got for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget about classic rock, country music, facts, and trivia. Um, it's on five uh, albums with Easter eggs on the front of them. Um, and when I'm saying Easter eggs, I mean like a hidden message on the album cover. It's pretty neat. Check that out. Please subscribe if you have not yet. Please like this video. You guys have a great day. God bless. I'm praying for you.